welcome to our channel NK Learning. Today we are going to learn how to create wave and moving water in 3ds Max. Let's start. Yeah, already I create one bridge and water flowing path. This water flowing path. Now I create water. Just go to geometry select plan create a plan water area then go to modifier you can name water and change the color like a water you select blue color Then I'm select hide unselected. I need to unwanted models. I want water object only for viewing purpose. Then go to modifier select noise. This is noise. Create your water waves and select Z wise. Z angle one feet. See, we have our one issue. Go to plan. You can increase the segment. To increase the segment, you have a smooth edges. See, like this. Lengthwise forty. And width wise 500 like this. Now we have a smooth edges. Now go to noise, go to Z angle and increase 1 feet. See. See that. Now we have a smooth edges and select the fractal. And select the factor like a wave effect then go to the Z angle increase the 9 inches Y angle not needed and go to enable the animate enable the animate noise and you decrease the frequency this is over fast and select 0 0.05 and this also fast I need more slow and 0 0.03 yeah this is fine this waves is fine okay waves is ready then go to moving Then I need flowing. Go to the noise and select open gizmo. Just adjust the flowing position. You can select zero frame, select auto key, just press Q and go to under frame. That will move the floating angle. Now set key. See the animation. The water was moving. The water was flowing like a flow effect. Now we have a wave and move moving water. See the wave and moving. The water was flowing. See the water was flowing. Little adjust, little down. Now perfect. See the water was flowing. Now very fast. Now go to time congregation. 
in frame 300 okay then adjust the keyframe go to 300 frame see now have a to slow slowly flowing the entire sequence was slow now is perfect you can increase the speed you can use this method and you can increase the waves go to the noise Z angle you can increase the value automatically the wave height increase you select 9 inches this is perfect increase the frequency see you can change anything your needs see the water see the water is flowing everything is perfect can change anything you can use this area you can increase the z angle the waves very high this is fine okay waves and the flowing is done then go to material water material i can select on new stone diffuse color blue Okay, now go to the water material then reflect 40 high glossiness 0 0.9 refract 150 see refract 150 is done 150 is fine just apply see then go to bump select noise go to bitmap select noise select a regular this is wave size 25 see the stone material stone okay fine then just apply see that water material is applied then go to the render just on check see the render the waves very high I need to color was still dark okay fine The material waves very high. I need to reduce. Go to the noise size was 10. Yeah, this is fine. Now check it out. See, this is fine. Okay, see the water. See the water material and go to render output or to the render output video select a water select the png format and select active segment active time segment 0 to 300 you can enable c total 300 300 frame was rendering one by one single png image render was going see the final output view and water flowing and moving animation in 3ds max thank you for watching please share and subscribe our channel thank you